Hi everyone! I just wanted to share some things with you that I picked up the last few days. Um, I'll start with Joanne and um, I stopped by their trim area and I picked up some very pretty laces and this is sort of a cream color. I just got small amounts. Um, I was trying to stay to a budget, stick to a budget, um, and this pretty one with the flowers is a white. The next one they call taupe, and um, this is just so gorgeous. Let's see if you can see that. It's just so pretty and so different. I had never seen one like that before. And then another white one with some very intricate designs on this piece of lace. And then I got some beaded trim in black. And so I mostly got about a quarter of a yard of each of these. And what I'm going to do, I also found some wooden clothespins. And what I'm going to do is wrap the uh, lace around each clothespin and secure it with a long pearlized pin and so I can keep them on display. Um, I'll have to show you that when it's done. And then also at Joann's I found um, this little pendant with a little dolphin jumping through a hoop. So I picked that up. And I picked up some flat back pearls in pink by Studio 112. And I also picked up some clear stamps, this cute little frame stamp, and then um, these flourishes I thought would be really nice on mixed media. So I got those two stamps. And then I um, picked up some beads, and these were only a dollar, and I thought they were um, perfect size for flower centers or stick pins. So I got um, this brown taupey color, and I got um, this pink color. This color is sort of a bluish black, sort of like a midnight blue. Then I got small ones in a bright pink, and then very, very um, beigey colored in that size. Also, while I was at Joanne, they had um, liquid soap by the register for a dollar, so I picked up a couple of scents that I wanted to try. Fresh Cotton, Lemon Twist, Peach Mango, and lavender vanilla. So I'm going to give those a try, see if I like them. I'm, I'm really, um, really picky about the scents of my liquid soap. They, they really have to smell, smell good. <laughs> um, so what else did I get? Let's see. I ran into Target for something. I don't. Oh, I think it was birthday presents for nephews, and um, I found these plastic bins and they were in the three dollar section so I got five of them and um, they're pretty deep and I thought they would be really good for different types of organization craft or other types of organization and then I've been loving everyone's candy stations they've been showing them so I thought oh maybe I could start my own candy station in my craft room so I went to a couple garage sales and um, I found this piece of I think it's milk glass it's white glass I guess it could be um, considered milk glass and um, it's just a very pretty and unique shape then I got the little one that looks like a tray and it's got like a little quilt pattern on the bottom so cute these were just um, a dollar at a yard sale. And then I got this one. Just thought it was very pretty. So I'm hoping to uh, get those filled with yummy things. <laughs> with yummy things and I'll, 
I'll hopefully be able to show you my candy station soon. While I was at another garage sale, I found this um, dictionary for a quarter. So I couldn't pass it up. It's got great font, of course, old-fashioned font. Um, it'll be perfect for mixed media, backgrounds and scrapbook pages, all kinds of things. So for a quarter, I couldn't pass that up. And then I stopped in Marshalls. Like I said, this was over a couple days. Um, I stopped in at Marshalls and I found this Martha Stewart Punch for $4.99. And this is the Four Petal Eyelet Punch. So I picked that up. And then they had um, Flatback Pearls and Lavender. And these were only $1.49. So I picked those up. The last thing I got was from Hobby Lobby. I was a little disappointed. I really didn't find a lot of good things or new things at my Hobby Lobby. So um, for $2.99 I picked up this little knob and I'm going to unscrew it and um, put it on the top of a project. And then I, I picked up some bowling stickers because my husband and I just finished our bowling league. We came in second place. <laughs> so I have some candid shots from him doing crazy things at bowling. So I'm going to do a couple scrapbook layouts about bowling. So that's really um, all I got in the last few days, guys. So um, I'm looking forward to all of your videos and um, I will work on getting my candy station going now that I have a couple pieces of milk glass and I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.